UNCDF specializes in finding digital solutions to increase financial inclusion, especially for people in rural areas. As of 2016, there was a massive influx of refugees, mainly from South Sudan, who came into Uganda. We wanted to bring communication closer to these refugees. We want them to communicate with their relatives within and outside where they came from. Uh, that's why we, we decided to bring this communication closer to uh, the refugees. The main advantage of MM4P project is that it helped humanitarian agencies operating in BDBD refugee settlement to digitalize their mode of payment. More than 15,000 project beneficiaries was registered on mobile money and were able to get a digital payment. At least on average, each beneficiary received eight payments. There are many challenges that have to be faced. We call that laying the rails. Uh, first of all, refugees need to have a phone. And how do we get refugees to own a phone? Then they need to have access to a SIM card. On top of getting a phone, we are given a free SIM card. Uh, that is what was done by Airtel just to help these refugees because we know they, they are not all that well. So we, we feel like giving them these SIM cards will also help in one way or another to connect to the network and then start communication as well. Uh, Airtel has done its part. Um, it has established a, a service center. A person may have uh, a SIM card having a problem. Uh, maybe it needs a replacement. He needs a pen reset. He forgot his pin. Uh, maybe for mobile money. So we brought these services closer to the, uh, the refugees uh, with the setup of the service center. We've also tried to place kiosks in all villages, in all zones within the camp, the BDB settlement camp. And we also support what we call booster teams. These are a group of trained Airtel staff who go into the settlements and explain beneficiaries what mobile money is, how you can use the menu on your phone, and how you can access this phone. Working together with UNCDF, build our capacity, made that understanding different component related to digital finance ecosystem. When we're starting BDBD refugee settlement, many agents thought of giving cash grant to beneficiaries to give them access to basic need. But there was a big challenge of means of transferring that cash. Uh, there was, it was risky to give cash in hand. We believe that going digital, as we say it, so making sure that beneficiaries receive cash-based transactions directly onto their mobile phone is the way to go. It is fast, it is secure, it ensures the privacy of the funds, and it allows people to take their own responsibility. Mm -hmm.